Welcome to the Enterprise CIO Minute. Let me ask you a question. What is the hardest thing to do in business? Now think about that. I happen to have the answer. And it came to me through the former CEO of Unisys, Jim Unruh, probably 20 years ago when we were sitting in his office talking about the collapse of the mini computer business. And we, and we were talking about the, the brilliant men that started the mini computer companies, the Ken Olson from Digital, uh, An Wang from Wang Labs, Joe Henson from Prime Computer, uh, Edson DeCastro from Data General. Brilliant people, yet to a person, their companies collapsed because they refused to embrace the greatest wave of change to come their way, which was the advent of microprocessor-based systems. They just ignored it, and the companies collapsed. Now, Microsoft almost collapsed in the mid-90s because it chose to ignore the Internet to a point. One day Bill Gates woke up, May of 1995 specifically, and wrote what's called the Internet Tidal Wave Memo to all his executives saying, we're going to embrace this new, delivery, this new delivery media, the Internet, which is threatening our business or else we're going to die. Well, by the end of the year, Microsoft had launched Windows 95 with Internet Explorer. It had launched the first online magazine, Slate, and it buried Netscape, and the rest is history. What did Bill Gates do that the others did not? He did the hardest thing to do in business. He made a decision that was contrary to what made him and Microsoft successful in the first place. And that is the hardest thing to do in business. It's the thing the mini computer guys did not do. And for CIOs, just remember this the next time there are truly big decisions looming in your theater of operations. Thank you for joining me in this Enterprise CIO Minute. I'm Bill LaBarris.